You're welcome to MDB Creative World. Hello, beautiful people. You're welcome to MDB Creative World. Today, we'll be learning how to make our do not turban cap. You can make this for your kids at home by yourself. Just you need it on your trade. You're done with it. You can make it for yourself also. It's called the do not turban cap. The fabric needed is our stretchy polo fabric and the measurement is 3 inches by 60 inches for the base for kids we can use 10 inches of fold that is 20 inches 20 inches that is 10 inches of fold by 12 inches or 11 inches depending on how you want it if it's for an adult you're going to use 24 inches by 12 inches or 13 inches in this tutorial we are trying to make this donut we are making this donut this donut is what we are making this donut for this donut to burn the kids normally use it we're going to be using our stretchy polo fabric our stretchy polo fabric is very very stretchy so we're going to put it like this on fold the fabric is on fold i'm going to cut out three inches going to be cutting out three inches out of it just like this i'm going to be cutting out three inches by 60 the length is 30, 60 inches the width is three inches so it depends how big you want to do not the next thing to do we tie this like this put it in your finger like this you see this is the all we need here so the next thing to do you can turn it upside down like this what i normally do i'll take off my needle and thread and i will try to tack it down so that it does not pull out it will help you to fasten your work so that you don't stress yourself that it's pulling out So after we, we can now start taking this like this, we'll be taking it in, What I do next now, I'll make sure I bend this one coming here to be covering each of the edges. This side will be straight, but this side will be bent, be folded. It's getting now, this one will bend again to cover this edge.
is only three inches by 60. If you want it to go bigger, you can add another fabric to it again. You can just take up another fabric and you start from there again. You start turning it. But if you want it to be small like this, what you do, you just take your needle and thread. After you have done that, after you have um, finished, take your needle and thread so that it does not pull off to start sewing. Sew it edge by edge. Look at it. Take the color of the, of the material. Don't use another color. So you see? So you tack it down. You see? There's our donuts. For the measurement of this, we are using 10. 10 on fold by 12 and a half. And I'm going to take it to my machine. This is because it's for a child. But if it's an adult, we'll be using 12, um, 11. We're using 11, which is 22. So I'm going to take it to the machine and fold this bottom part. I'm going to sew it like this. I'm going to put it on fold like this. And I will sew. So I'll do that off camera and I'll be back. Thank you. So after sewing this, I'm going to join it like this. I'm going to take my needle and thread. I'm going to tack it from this end to this other end. I'm going to tack it together. So I'll take my needle and thread. You must not join them together. We are doing it from one end to another, like so. So this is it. This is the part we folded in. So you do it like this. Let that part be inside. Then we join it like this. done joining it like this the next thing is to add our donut so this is our donut so we'll place it like this i'll start tackling it down go up and down bit going inside inside out go through the same part and bend your needle you see So you see, we are going inside out, we will tack it down like this on the edges. So the next one now will start going on the edge, go in, come out. So I will do the remaining off camera and I will be back. As you can see, here is the outcome of our cap, here is the outcome. And see here it is this is the conclusion after attaching your donuts to this needle this is how it looks like thank you for watching today's video tutorials click on the subscription button if you have not done that just click on the subscription button to see more of our videos that we will be uploading and whatever design you want to learn you can just send a picture to me on my dm or on the comment section Place the picture there, I'll make a design and I'll send to you. Thank you very much for your time. See you.